Hi guys, just an update on your strategic business reporting paper. So this used to be the P2 paper under the old syllabus and there's been a bit of a change. Not much of a change because essentially the syllabus remains the same. The only thing you now don't have is complex groups. So complex groups are off the syllabus but everything else stays on and everything else remains the same. However, the exam is changing. So you used to have a big groups question to do in question one. So that question has now gone. They're going to have a group question, but it's going to be extracts rather than preparing a full group uh, statement of financial position, P&L or cash flow statement. So that's a bit of a change. It's going to take a different format than it did in the past. So secondly, then you must do all the questions on the paper. So there used to be a choice, but now there's not. So no, no choice when it comes to the questions on the paper, you must do them all. Thirdly, you used to have a current issues question in question four, which was a full 25 mark question on current issues. Now there still may well be current issues and will be current issues, within the paper, but it won't form as much of the paper. It won't be a full 25 mark question. So no big group at the start, no complex groups. You must do all the questions that are asked and there won't be a specific full question on current issues. Aside from that, the syllabus remains the same. The thing I do want you to think about though is that they're taking a slightly different perspective on this. They're now taking more of a look at the investor perspective. So you will see when you're looking at the questions a slightly different approach in terms of how the question is worded. It will often be about preventing manipulation of accounts. There's much more ethics throughout the paper. So ethics will form a, a much greater part looking for problems that might arise through different accounting treatments. So there is a slight different um, look to the paper, a slightly different feel, but in essence, the syllabus remains the same. So nothing to worry about if you've studied the syllabus before, it's the same stuff, but do have a good look at the specimen papers so that you get a good feel for how this exam is going to look moving forward.